Hey there, this is Jan from DAD Audio. Uh, we have a couple of really cool little firmware updates happening here in the, the release that's 2025-0501. Couple of things that people have really been asking for for a long time, which is now possible. The first one being microphone gain linking. So you're linking, you're, um, you're able now to link your inputs, your microphone inputs uh, into ganged groups. Uh, as you can see here in my X32 on my X Center, I now have groups that I can go in and l link them all together. All of these are linked in a group. I can move them. You'll hear the lovely clicking of our wonderful preamps, and they're all going to work together. Hold down the shift for more granular control in, in 0.1 dB changes. Um, if you hold down the alt, move something, it will be temporarily suspended from the group. Also, you can combine those two, alt and shift will be temporarily suspended, so solo, and with the, uh, with the um, granular control. Control. Very, very exciting, something that people have been asking for for a long time, and it's going to be um, a huge feature for everyone who's doing things like classical recording and location recording that needs a lot of stuff to happen all at the same time. All right, um, then something on the simple side, on the device list, you're now able to go in and sort your things by name. Uh, it seems like a small thing for some people, for, but those people who have like big systems, it's great to be able to name stuff and be able to have them sorted as such. So if you do not already have our control pack functionality, please, do you have a Thundercore product? Go get it right now from digitalaudiosupport.com. Log in, download, do the firmware update, do the Datman update, anything you need to do because you will get the control pack. Control pack will make your life a lot easier and a lot more fun. So I already have a system here, which is sort of set up, you know, showing a, a sort of traditional playback system. It's not really what we're gonna focus on right now. That's gonna be a different video. But essentially, all those lovely colors that shows, you know, which of these packs that you've chosen, which one is going back and forth, all of that stuff. It used to only be here in the Dadman window. And when you were then went into your routing presets here, you would have a window that looked a little bit like this, so no colors or anything. Now, when you you are doing your when you're doing your uh, configuration of this it now happens dynamically which means you can see whether or not your pilot tone or your AE6 is coming in on the different things that will it will automatically and dynamically update when you're doing it so as you can see here uh, when anything fails, this is not failing, this is me showing that it can fail, um, essentially will happen here. So it's very nice for you to dynamically be able to sit and do your setup. When you're doing your backtrack or your automatic switchover functionality, you can test it within the routing preset window without having to uh, consult with the main DAD uh, window. All right, that is really all for now. Um, download the latest firmware update, I beg you. Um, install it. Have fun and let us know how you feel about it. <laughs>